Hey book buddies, today I'm going to be doing a book review on Close My Eyes by Sophie McKenzie. Now this is a thriller, like a crime thriller, suspense crime thriller type book. So if you like um, Gone Girl or Before I Go to Sleep, like those kind of books that just sort of mess with your head and ruin your thought process <laughs> temporarily then in a really good way then this review is up for you and this book is definitely for you as well let's go Close My Eyes is about Jennifer eight years ago um, she had a stillborn baby a daughter Beth and Beth was the closest after six failed IVF treatments and many other treatments that her and her husband Art had gone through um, Beth was the closest that they had ever come to having a baby so eight years present day um, Jennifer is still holding on to Beth and Art is still pushing to have kids and now they're considering adoption because their options are running out now on what they can do to have a child and Art really wants to start a family his business is starting to take off and he's social climbing and he's doing really well for himself but Jennifer just really isn't there and she's really stuck with Beth eight years ago so um, Jennifer's life is thrown even into more turmoil when a stranger, a credible stranger, knocks on her door and he is told that her daughter isn't in fact dead, that she is alive and she's out there and she can be reunited with her if she is willing to pursue that. So Jennifer finding out this information is mentally conflicted about what to do if she believes this information that she gets to have her daughter be part of her life but then if she and and but if she goes there and finds out like what's happened to her and goes down that road then obviously people have been lying to her and she's been deceived and that raises questions obviously about her husband and what Art may be up to. Jennifer does go on a quest and questions are raised and the answers that are coming back are shocking and they keep coming and she doesn't know who she can trust and the one person that she does have some trust in she's also been misled about so this book never gives up on hitting you with shocking revelation after revelation really it is just amazing to read it's such a good book it's beautifully written and honestly the only thing that I can think that I've read that comes close to it would be um, Gone Girl and Before I Go to Sleep that is just such an amazing twist I definitely recommend this. Um, you'll absolutely love it. I'll leave some information in the um, down bar so that if you want more to be more educated about this book and the author Sophie McKenzie, then um, I'll leave some information. So thanks, guys. I'm sorry this is a quick one. I really just wanted to try and do this review without spoiling because I'm so horrible and I always give away spoilers but um, I'm really trying this time so I hope you like the video and I'll see you next week for Book Review Tuesday bye hi guys today I'm going to be talking about the accidental life of Jesse Jefferson by page 2